So guys, I'm doing another video about Bryant Security. Stephanie, happy, healthy, 96. Recently got her Trekamonda, red Trekamonda, stolen thing is Vancouver. Keep an eye out for it. It's got a 32 cassette in the back. Easy to spot, but this is what I do recommend people. If you live in Australia, out, anywhere outside of Thailand, then this is the sort of lock you're gonna need, a D-lock. And you have to lock it to the frame, through the frame and through an immovable post. Not a post you can sort of swivel out the ground and ride off of the bike, but it has to be to the frame against an immovable object. So someone like myself, you could, if I was standing there, you could lock the bike to my leg and the frame because I'm immovable. But that's what you want to do. A D-lock, this is a Kryptonite one, it has a combination stock, so it's great. Don't have to worry about any keys. But if you live in a high uh, theft area, then you need to have at least two or three of these. So let's say I lived in London and I'm riding my bike to work. Then I would have all st vegan stickers all over it. I'd be riding a nice bike, but I have about fucking three locks and I'd leave these locked at my workplace or locked to the bike rack. I'd just lock them, boom, 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 done. People who are gonna steal your bike will steal it. But the, the reality is, thieves are lazy. So they're gonna steal a bike that's fucking easy to get. They want something, most bike thieves are heroin addicts, crack addicts, smackies. They want something they can sell in the next five minutes, 10 minutes for 100 bucks, 50 bucks. They'll sell you a $5,000 bike, 50 bucks, 100 bucks. Boom, they just wanna get rid of it and go. So if it's got stickers on it, if it's got fucking covered in locks, they're gonna not worry about it. What if you're out riding in Thailand, D-locks on that, I use a, a chain lock, I have it around my waist, so when I rode to the trail this morning, just lock this up around the post. Now I pull this down, you see, it's, that's a chain, it's not very, it's, it's secure, but you get through that for an angle grind of bolt cutters, boom, boom, snip, snip, it's through. But it's gonna prevent 99.9% of bike feeds in Thailand. There's not many bike feeds here, but this is a great lock, it's rather well, master lock, can't really read that, master lock, about a thousand baht, 30, 40 bucks, it's a combo, so it's great, if you don't have to worry about keys, but, so, you need to have a lock if you want to prevent your bike getting stolen, or just have bike insurance. You don't even lock your bike. <laughs> have, have bike insurance, but I don't like getting my bike stolen personally. I have insurance and I have good locks because for me it's a pain in the ass getting my bike stolen because I spend my like, time getting fitted up and customizing it. I don't want to have to fucking buy another bike when I can avoid that. So otherwise, yeah, definitely have bike insurance if you worry about that. But more importantly, good locks, good locks because people steal bikes. Uh, unfortunately, they're, they're cunts, but uh, and no one's going to prevent. A spot in there. No one's gonna stand up for you. Like it's so easy to steal bikes, man. Because you just walk up an angle grind, a portal angle grind, literally that quick. Pop, pop, done. Thanks for coming. Ten thousand dollar bike, thousand dollar bike, like that. And if anyone walks up and says, "Hey, what are you doing, man? You steal the bike?" No, no, it's not stealing the bike, bro. This is this is my bike. I left my keys at home. Oh, okay, no, okay, no worries. What are they going to do? They're going to do fucking nothing. You're, boom, you're out of there. Even the cops walking up. There's plenty of uh, videos on that. I think the Nice Stack Brothers did a video how easy to steal bikes. It's so fucking easy, man. It's easy to steal bikes. No one's going to do shit. So make sure you have insurance or you have really, really good locks. So unfortunately, I learned the hard way. I've had bikes stolen myself. Um, it's not a pleasant experience, but... That is the thing. I've done plenty of videos about this before. Before I do another video, update it because people are getting more into bikes and stuff. So have a lock if you and ca can't use, cannot use fucking cable locks. You may as well use a lock like that, a fucking USB cable. Cables are shit. You cut through cables like butter. You got to have at least a D lock. Cable locks maybe in Thailand, but D lock definitely anywhere outside of Thailand. D lock. D it. Brands to get. Kryptonite. Abus. I post down below what I recommend on guard. Heavy duty, expensive locks, good quality shit. 